Hi, Jesse. I keep finding traces of Darling, but still can't find him. Where could he be? He's usually in his office in research, or one of his labs. Dr. Darling has quite a few, all around the Bureau. Could be hiding in any one of them. I check myself, but I don't have access to most of them. Sounds like I touched a nerve. He didn't let you into his labs? Not all of them, no. Some had volatile material. It's ridiculous. I mean, this whole place is volatile material. Could have at least thought of a more convincing lie. I mean, how can I work without access to all the data possible? This place has a bad habit of moving around, huh? So you notice the building shifts. Did you know that 39% of bureau accidents are caused by the shifts? It's true. I ran the numbers myself. So they're dangerous. Oh, very. Yet one time, a shark got shifted into a meeting room along with over 2,000 gallons of water. It was a tiger shark, Darling's pet research project. I forget what he was researching. How do people work here? You said you're an assistant? Oh, it's just a title. I'm a scientist, a researcher. I work for Dr. Darling. See, when bureau agents go out in the field, the sites of altered world events, we study the materials, the altered items they bring back. It's always something we've never seen before, and studying them requires new instruments, methodologies, sometimes entirely new fields of science. Emily really loves her job. See, there's no guidebook for what we do here. Everything that happens at the bureau, including the science, is without precedent. What exactly is the Ocean View Motel? That's a bigger question than you might think. You see, I have extreme doubts that the motel is a single place. I mean, look at all the doors inside it. Where do they all go? We know that one door leads to the oldest house, but how come we can only ever open that one door? Maybe to open a door, you have to have entered through it. So if every door leads to a different dimension, plane, reality, whatever you want to call it, then I believe that the motel is firm proof that parallel universes exist. Does Darling agree with that? I haven't told him yet. I'm waiting until I can prove it. What can you tell me about control points? They're nexus points of the oldest house's unique energies. Now, I wrote a 30-page proposal hypothesizing that we could siphon energy directly from them. Darling didn't even get through the first page before he turned it down. Right. And, uh, has anyone ever used them to teleport around? What? Uh, no. What, I mean, you mean physically? No, not that I've ever heard of. Why? Because that's how they work for me. What? Really? Oh my god. More tests. Let's hold off on the tests until later, okay? Okay. It's just... Wow. I mean, this blows my control point theories right out of the water. I love it. See you soon. Be careful out there.